surgical outcomes of patients with primary aldosteronism lateralized with I131-6 beta iodomethyl norcholesterol single photon emission, computed tomography without discontinuation or modification of antihypertensive medications. By Chia Hui Chang via Tsuchi Medical Journal, 2018-33. Chia Hui Chang, Stephen Shai Di Ying, Yao Chu Tsai, Shi Wen Kuo, Xia Chitran, Ching Chu Lu, Rua Feng Yan, Van Sent Wu, Ya Hui Hu. Tsuchi Medical Journal 2018-33, 169-175. Objectives Adrenocortical scintigraphy for patients with primary aldosteronism, PA, without discontinuation or modification of antihypertensive medications is of concern because of drug interference with the renin-angiotensin aldosterone system. We report the surgical outcomes of patients with PA lateralized with adrenocortical scintigraphy without drug discontinuation or modification. Materials and Methods, we retrospectively reviewed 34 patients with PA with computed tomography, CT documented adrenal tumors who had undergoing subsequent I131-6 beta iodomethyl norcholesterol, NP59, single photon emission CT, SPECT slash CT followed by unilateral adrenlectomy according to the results of NP59 uptake between May 2005 and December 2014. All enrolled patients underwent standard confirmatory tests and lateralization with NP59 SPECT slash CT without discontinuation of existing antihypertensive medications, including spironolactone. The pathological findings hypertension outcomes, and biochemical changes were reported. The accuracy of NP59 SPECT slash CT without drug discontinuation or modification was also evaluated. Results, none of the 34 enrolled patients, MF equals 1618, had complications such as a hypertensive crisis, life-threatening hypoglymic event, or cardiac arrhythmia. Pathology disclosed 31. 91%, adenomas and 3 cases of hyperplasia. Hypertension cure and improvement were observed in 12, 35%, and 18, 53%, patients, respectively. All of the 30 patients, 100%, without postoperative use of beta blockers and with an available postoperative aldosterone, renin ratio achieved a biochemical cure. The positive predictive values of NP59 SPECT slash CT were 91%, 88%, and 100% for the pathological findings, hypertension outcomes, and biochemical changes, respectively. Conclusion, non-invasive NP59 SPECT slash CT without discontinuation or modification of antihypertensive medications not only provided accurate lateralization and safety but also resulted in a high improvement rate for PA-associated hypertension. Ad tags, currently, medicine by Alexandros G. Sfakianakis, 